Mikey, I told you to fix the ladder box. Sorry, bro. Where is it? There. How to make a basketball quick and easy in Blender. As a former basketball enthusiast, I thought that maybe I'll try to add a basketball as a little asset to my underground scene. But I couldn't quite figure out how to do it the easiest way until now. So here's the quick and easy tutorial on how to texture a basic basketball in Blender. We're in Asia today everybody. Let's start by opening Blender. Simply delete the default cube by hitting X on your keyboard. Now add a sphere and we're almost done with the modeling. Go into top orthographic view with 7 and then 5 on your number. Now select the edge loop as shown by pressing Alt right click to select a single loop and shift Alt right click to select multiple loops. Hide the selected loops with H and now delete the bigger part of the mesh. This leaves you with a slice of lemon skin. Go into edit mode again and hide everything with Alt H. Now press U to unwrap it. Next up we add a mirror modifier and select both X, Y and clipping. This way we have the UV maps overlapping. The results for our basketball texture are much better this way than by simply selecting generate sphere or UV unwrapping the sphere with sphere protector. That's enough about spheres for now. Let's add a material and change its name. Delete the specularity influence. and add an image texture. Select the image texture basketball lines that I provide. Define the texture mapping by selecting generate sphere. Go all the way down to influence and select color, normal, RGB to intensity to only use the black color and negative to switch black and white so we actually see the lines. Also select best quality for your bump mapping. You can also select the low value for extra specularity if you want. If you render now, there are our lines. I've blurred or felt their outlines a bit to support the transition of depth. Now add another texture, move it up over the first line's texture and there's your basketball. For a bit of enhancement, we we'll add two more textures for bump and spec. Move the line's texture two slots down and create two copies of your basketball texture. Hit the numbers next to the texture name respectively to make separate copies. Name them Specularity and Bump. For the Specularity texture, steer out the saturation in the color field and add a bit of contrast. Now we go to Influence and enable Specularity, disable color. My value of choice is at 0 0.117. Also deset the bomb texture. My brightness is at 0.5, the contrast at 2.3. Let's use the UV texture also and define normal value of your liking. Mine is at 0.1 with the best quality enabled. If you want your ball to be a better sphere, add a multi-resolution modifier and increase the subdivision. Disable subdivide UVs for better results. And well, that's it already. Have fun with your basketball. Leave me a comment if there's anything you need help with and please subscribe for future tutorials and to watch our web series once we re release the first webisode. Thank you, I'm the Moon Man, wishing you a monacious time. Goodbye.